Giorgio. I'm here for just a do the cooking. And my cugina, JD, he do the cooking. So it's take the turn. So Giorgio wanted to uh, say what the uh, ingredients was to lasagna. Hey, how are you? We got the sausage, peppers, red peppers, tomato sliced, rogata, basil, parsley, a bigger dish, lasagna noodles, oh boy, mozzarella, and some olive oil. That's how we make this lasagna. Continue, JD. Work hard. I'm gonna watch you. So I start with some olive oil. Got a pepper in there. Yeah. And put a little olive oil on the bottom of the pan. This is a china dish. I usually use china for lasagna. Okay, make sure it covers it. Back to the side. And push it around like this a little bit. You need two spoons, okay? Alright, for application. Alright, so we're going to start with the noodles. Put the box of noodles here. And. Lay them in like so. Okay. Got about three here. Okay. And then I'm going to go in with some sauce. Okay. Pour it in. And here's where the spoon comes in handy. Push it around like this. A little more. Okay. A little more. Okay. It's kind of like making a cake. We did have this in Italy once, and let me tell you folks, it was delicious. It was like so thin. It was like eating uh, a tort cake, actually. And we're going to put fresh tomatoes. Okay. That's one layer. Okay. the cheese okay you can dump that in there like that that's a terrible word isn't it dump okay it'll 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 um when it heats up it'll it'll spread out and I'm studying stuttering today here a little bit I'm sorry about that okay Go in with the cheese. Okay, some cheese. And that mozzarella cheese. Like so, some sausage. Okay, cut it up, grind it up. Put some sausage in there. some red peppers in there the size of the dish denotes how big your lasagna is going to be these these um happen to fit good now just pat it down a little bit you know and let it settle in and get go back to the noodles she almost lost Two, three, okay, like so, and then sauce, sauce on, okay. spread it all around the noodles, the sauce and all that and the oil will help cook the noodles, these are the kind you don't have to boil, okay. again put that on top I'm gonna have enough left over probably to make another one and 
And we're going to omit the uh, tomatoes. We've got plenty on the bottom. And we'll go back to the sausage. It depends how much you want on one lasagna or whatever. You know, um, as far as ingredients. It's almost like making a pizza of lasagna, if you think about it. We're going to cook this at 400 degrees for about three quarters of an hour. And a little more red pepper because we like that. Okay. More red pepper. More sausage. Okay. And then put on the mozzarella cheese again. This is the finished, the top finished coat. Okay. Of the lasagna. It's only a two layer lasagna. I don't have a huge pan to make it. So, maybe you want to go with a little parsley on top for a topping. And some basil. Okay. That's how it looks before it goes in the oven. Now we're going to put it in the oven. I'll show it to you later. Giorgio, you like her? You make her. You know like her? You know make her. So let's take that um, lasagna out of the oven. Get us two little pads here. Always use these. Oh my goodness. It's hot. Oh. There's one. I got another one in there. But Everything's very well, nicely cooked. On the average, you can cook um, lasagna 45 minutes with nothing in it, okay, as far as ingredients. I highly suggest letting this all cool down and cutting it with this egg spatula, like cake pieces, okay? And when you let it cool down completely, you cut it and you can warm it up in the microwave slightly if you want it warm. So that's how you make lasagna, and I thank you for watching. I make a shaky cooker, don't worry. <laughs> See you next time. Ciao.